will this vlog be a great success? Well, it's kind of, that's a bad sign. <laughs> sucks being sick it's not awesome I am so behind because I'm, I'm sorry guys I was sick on Monday and uh, it threw me off because that's my edit day my shoot day so I was sick I dropped a behind the scenes vlog and I hope you liked it I don't know something silly I don't know, whatever but I'm better now I'm like I feel okay anyway this is vlog oh my gosh I'm already <laughs> guys I've done so many I've lost track Yep, this is vlog five. The behind the scenes vlog was like vlog 4.2. So this is vlog five. So this vlog was about downtown Mesa. Downtown Mesa is pretty cool. Back in the day, my mom said she used to cruise downtown Mesa. I don't know, she, apparently she went to high school in the 50s. That's the only time I've heard of cruising. <laughs> she didn't, my mom's not that old. So we wanted just to highlight some businesses. So Rihanna and I went and got lunch, coffee, ice cream, shopped, I spent I spent a lot of money, like a little bit more than I wanted to. Anyway, you're gonna learn a lot about me in this vlog, and it's gonna seem put on, it's gonna seem like I'm doing this for a vlog because like no way is that true, no way does she actually like that. Uh, not true, it totally, totally, uh, totally valid, and downtown for me is like walking through, it's like my kryptonite, my weakness. Old books, old records, old music, coffee, and food. It was so awesome, and hey! Hello. Hi, I like your outfit by the way. Oh. So to get the day started, we needed to get some lunch. And we went to one of our favorite places. Been here before, many times. Pretty stop. <laughs> Why is it not working? Pretty, it's okay. That'll do, it's been like Got 10 him. minutes. 10 ah. hours later. <laughs> 10 hours, I'm gonna so put that in. Four hours later. <laughs> so we're just gonna hang around. We're just gonna hang around downtown today. Uh, Check out you. some of the shops. Thank you. Well, anyway, we're gonna go to eat. I'm not gonna tell you on the vlog. We're gonna eat. We're just gonna cut there right now. Public Empanada, Hibbert's, and First Avenue. Hello. You've been here before, right? Have you ever had a dessert empanada? I no. Oh, come on. Okay, the Dizzy Fig has actually won top 10 desserts in Phoenix a couple times. Thank you. Thank you so much. We're gonna go eat outside because it's beautiful out and it's almost summer and this is never gonna happen again. Mesa Urban Garden's right next door. This is seriously one of our favorite places downtown. Thank you so much. Are you gonna film me eating? Done. I don't I don't like whatever that is. Yes. Here's the deal. Those are empanadas? Or a must. So good. Do I have on my nose? What? Do I? Oh. <laughs> it was amazing. The dessert empanadas, amazing. So good. I didn't even know they had dessert empanadas. I've been there like five times. You know how cheated I feel not knowing that they had those? So cheated. But they're amazing. Really good. So anyway, we had lunch and then we were ready to go shopping. This is it. It's downtown. All right, let's go. Just kidding, we're gonna show you around. You're sitting on our building. This is our building. Oh hey, John Bobby. How's it going? Good. How are you? I'm doing good. You know, just not causing trouble. Doing <laughs> just doing normal citizen. Kind yeah, of thing, no right? normal citizen stuff. There you go. Nothing crazy. One of the 
big staples downtown is Milano's huge music store. You play an instrument? I used to play the piano. Hi, can we check out here? What shops do you guys go to today? This is our first one. We just went to lunch at Republican Banana. Cool. I really love that thrift store or that like antique shop that goes like down. Oh, that has yeah, yeah, yeah. That has the basement. Mm -hmm. Thank yeah. you. Take care. Thank you. Then we went to Gotham Comics. Now, I had never been in the store, and I'm not much of a comic book person. Uh, Rihanna, I don't think, owns any. So I was interested to go in just because I know it's kind of a staple downtown. The comic books, Rihanna? I may or may not have written a 35 page paper on Star Trek. Oh. My. Gosh. And guys, I never would have thought I would have found what I found there. Okay, James Taylor. I have a selfie with James Taylor. Put that selfie right here. Oh my gosh, I love James Taylor so much! I know. I know guys. No big deal. I met James Taylor and we have a selfie together. Kind of a big deal. Just a little bit. So I bought that because... <laughs> Duh. You seen our new mural on the back wall? Well, thank you so yeah. much. Thank you. Just go out back. Just go stand in front of it, look cool. Really awesome store. Uh, I like it a lot. So behind, behind Main Street, since we came out here, all the parking. Rihanna, I'm getting this on camera. I cannot buy anything else today, do you understand? Yeah, it's been documented. Okay. I can. Oh, this is cool. Yeah. Next was the bookstore. Now, Rihanna is a nerd. Okay, guys, like, she doesn't seem like a nerd. She graduated ASU Magnum Cum Laude Math, okay? She's a nerd. We are in a book club right now, and she's, like, page 100 in. I'm a page 6. You know, give me time. So the bookstore was Rihanna's one request doing this downtown thing because she has never been in there. And we were in there for quite a long time. Crime and Punishment. It's my favorite book of all time. It's about a guy who commits murder just to see if he can get away with it. It's set in Russia in like 1800s, late 1800s. It's been a while since I read it. Are you getting it? I have to. Said. I know Rihanna, but I have to. I have a serious problem. Yeah, that was just like Beauty and the Beast. I know. I think any cool old downtown needs to have a record store. I'm so glad we have one. After you, my dear. my favorite band. Here's me in a bread t-shirt with a beanie looking super hipster. Oh my gosh. <coughs> I've spent so much money I can't. I really can't. Is this thing real life right now? Oh my gosh, that's heavy. The handle indicates that you can pick it up, but the weight says otherwise. Okay guys, Rihanna's found her first purchase of the day, which makes me feel very... You're not gonna get it? In what way do you not want to get that? 
for buying a house and I can't spend money. She has willpower, man. Like, get good on her. Record stores and to go in and hold an album, a vinyl album is so cool and it, I'm kind of glad it's coming back just because it's a cool experience. And so this store is awesome. I'm so glad it's downtown. So antique shopping is big. We have many antique shops in downtown. This was one of them that we went into. Some serious moment. I cannot buy anything in here. Do you understand? I don't care if I said no, I want it. I don't care if I said I have the money. Ask not what your country can do for you, but ask what you can do for your country. What do you think? Amazing. You can join the army? You have the trunk? Smell the trunk? Smell it. I can't. <laughs> You're right. I can't smell anything. I'm not gonna smell any more trunks, we gotta go. I mean, I know it looked like I had six empanadas for lunch because I basically had six empanadas for lunch, but I still was hungry. And Slickables, I've never been in there, heard a lot about it. Cool ice cream shop downtown. So I had to go and check it out. We're going in here. Hi. Do you want to eat them? Hi. Hi. How's it going? Good. Awesome. Thank you. <laughs> Hi. How are you doing? Good. How tired are you? I'm really tired. How much do you want this ice cream? A lot. Uh, yeah. I'm getting a little bit of judgment from Rihanna, making me feel bad about myself. It's delicious. You want a bite? See? Always. I get something and she wants a bite. Every time. Yeah, it is. Well done, Slickables. Well done. So then we went to Blossom, which is more of a boutique type store. There's a salon in the back of it. Clothes, sunglasses, jewelry, all that good stuff. Ooh, pretty. Ooh, those are so you. I have one, but it's actually. Don't film me until your mom's shows are done. These look awesome. Yeah, hey, what do you think? She said no. What? Don't tell me what to do. Hey, puppy. There are many coffee shops downtown, which I am an advocate of. And whenever I go out of town anywhere, I want to go to a local coffee place. And in Mesa, we have a plethora, which I think that is amazing. So there's many. Wolstead is the one that we went to that day. And I'm there all the time. I have a punch card. It's, it's a thing. It's an addiction. But you know what? I'm managing it, okay? So, you know, it's fine. Let's just do a latte, medium latte, hot. hot. So I spent more money than I thought I would. More money than me. Seriously though, like this isn't just because we're a vlog from the city of Mesa. Literally. The shops were really cool. Fun. People will be looking at me like I'm crazy. I'm just a little bit crazy. Bye bye Main Street. Until next time. Until tomorrow. <laughs> the vibe downtown, just passing the different shops. Um, Queens had their this cool door open. I mean, it's just a cool vibe. The light rail comes right past. There was, you know, it's walkable. The walkability there is great. Idea museums downtown. The history museums downtown. The Mac is downtown. Uh, so we just mainly did the main drag and shopping uh, and eating, like what you can do and mingle. But there's gonna be many more vlogs coming about specific things that are just in downtown. There's just too many just to do on one. So this is not over, my friends. But. We did have a specific request. Courtney is watching the vlog. She's a local teen in Mesa. She asked if Jared's tea house was gonna be on the vlog or the bungalow. And they, we didn't go to those that day. 
but I've been to Jared's many times. In fact, on grid bike day, we went to Jared's afterwards to get lemonade, and I shot some stuff in it that way I didn't even use. And then Rihanna and I also decided to go to Bungalow for lunch today. I'm gonna go shoot it really quick, go to lunch and eat there today and show it because it's like her favorite place and I've never been there, Rihanna's never been there. So we're gonna go do that like right now. Okay, Courtney. Courtney, this place is so cool. Thank you so much. Rihanna, what do you think about our new lunch box? It's so cute. I know, I we're didn't even at know. the bungalow, right? That's what it's called? Yeah. Thanks for the suggestions, Courtney. Your favorite places are mighty good picks. So it just goes to show that people who are in downtown Mesa and know the area, they have their niche places they go to and they love them and they're excited about them and they're loyal to them. So much art and culture downtown that's really unique and specific to that area. And I love that. It brings so much character and vibrancy to a place into that one street. There's so much going on down that one little section of Main Street in Mesa. So if you haven't checked it out, you should. So vlog six, I never know which way it is. One of the suggestions was teach for a day. They didn't necessarily hand us over a classroom and say, here, uh, instruct our youth. We and Rihanna went and we followed a teacher at Lincoln Elementary School, second grade for one day. That's vlog six, vlog six. Look for it next Tuesday, that will drop. This is vlog five and it's over. I don't have an out for this one. I'm just gonna turn the camera away from me and point it at Lily.